Mordremoth has already claimed too many victims. Do you think the Pale Tree will recover? Our mother is resilient, but the Mordrum tore at her in ways we don't fully understand. We know it affected her mind. She fades in and out of awareness, but she said she was able to protect the dream from the assault. But at what cost to herself? Someone's coming. Good news, hopefully. Friend, she's aware now, but we can never predict for how long. Follow me, please. Mother, I've brought the Pact Commander who asked to see you. Good. I was hoping to see you soon. The Vision. First seed, here in the grove. It's where Kaith's roots are. Ask me if you have any other questions about them. Oh, please, Traherne. Don't tell me you're up here contemplating the words of a long-dead centaur. I know what you think of Ventari's tablet, but I find wisdom in it. Do you even consider other views? Filling the heads of this new crop with only one side doesn't seem responsible. Ventari's tenants will help them make something of themselves, my dear. All sentient beings feel that urge. Exactly. To make something of themselves not to live up to someone else's ideal of what they should be. Kate, can we talk for a moment? After the gathering today, we must corner Wynne and get her to tell us what she was talking to Mother about. You're obsessing again. 
You know how we night blooms are about our secrets. This is important, Case. She knows something that could hold sway over all Silvari. That's not trivial. <laughs> you don't know that's true. You overheard a portion of a conversation out of context, no less. I know. Come on, we're going to be late for the gathering. are meeting. What do you suppose they're going to talk about? I imagine they're as surprised as we are that we awoke. Do you suppose they want us gone? Don't be ridiculous. I tried again to talk to Kiara. Seriously, why don't you just leave her be? She doesn't want company. Over two years. That's how long the others were here all alone. Just the Twelve. It explains why they're so intimate with one another. I wish I'd been one of them. The elders follow without thinking. This tablet, it's a farce. They cling to it because it tells them how to behave. But we, we have our own minds. We do not swallow whole the old philosophies. We are better than that. Can you meet tomorrow night to discuss the tablet? Midnight. Hmm, I'll be there. It'll be good to speak with others of a similar mind. Thank you all for coming. We're here to discuss our newly awakened and how we can best assist them. You say assist, but you mean mold. You want to make them all into your version of good little Silvari. No. As firstborn, it is our responsibility to care for and guide these... second-born. The newly awakened, let's not call them second-born, could benefit from our knowledge of Antari's tenants. Oh, please. I'd love to be an ant at their feet, to hear what they're saying. There they go again, probably talking about us. Look at me that way, Wynne. You know I'm right. Whatever your secret is, I'll dig it out of you. I have no secret. You know everything I know. Don't lie to me. I heard you whispering to Mother. I heard you say there was something that could give unspeakable power over all Silvari. What were you talking about? I have to go. I'm traveling to a centaur refuge in the Silver Wastes to research Ventari. We'll talk later, Fallon. Elders, I bring grave news. Please, listen. Take a deep breath, Sapling. What's your hurry? Small, imp-like creatures. We just wanted to explore beyond Mother's roots. They appeared out of nowhere. Asura, I guess. Malamedes had an encounter with them not long ago. He was lucky to survive. Where did they go? They took them northwest into the forest. What was that? I followed what them a while, but then I felt I should come get help. They said something about returning to Metrica before I lost their trail. Kaith, Fowlin, you two had the most experience in the wild. Would you scout ahead? The second born are precious. We cannot allow them to be killed to assuage some ignorant race's curiosity. At last, something we agree on, Traherne. I can't wait to teach these imps a lesson. You and me, together, we'll rescue as many as we can. They treated Malamedes terribly. I hope they're not so harsh with this group. They're going to remember the day they met the two of us.
nice gear. get to see our sleeping Hylic. This is the place? It's run by Inquest. We'll have to be careful. I'll watch your back while you're in the vision. Right. We need to go in stealthily and see if we can take them by surprise. There are too many of them to attack head on. Hold up a second. Why are you so interested in Cadiern and his dissenters? It's simple, really. From the moment we awakened, our mother has molded us into an idealized version of nobility. She doesn't see or care who we are, so long as we match her ideal of us. I felt it too. The pressure to be perfect. Yes. And the pain that comes with failing to live up to her expectations. Why can't she love us unconditionally? She claims to believe that all weeds and blossoms are equal, yet she tries to make us all into blossoms. I love you, just as you are. We belong together. Come on, my darling. Let's go rescue our sprouts. Put your hand on my arm. But if your way fails, we do it my way. Stay close. There's a guard ahead. Take it out from behind. I keep hearing things. Huh. Oh. Great. Now we can get that gate open. Lovely. That imp didn't see a thing, because we took it down first. Now we can get in. 
What an odd smell. Can someone bring me an Aether Slicer, please? Raise the alarm! There's a creature in here! <laughs> <laughs> over. Constructs look like they could detect us if we get too close. Unexpected sound registered. Investigating. Log. Query answered. Unexpected sound it turned was off door panel. panel. You should reactivate it when that thing is away. Deactivated per security protocol 988C. Registering unexpected noise. Investigating. Log. Deactivating door. Alerting repair team of potential malfunction. Registering unexpected noise. Investigating. Log. Deactivating door. Alerting repair team of potential malfunction. Registering unexpected noise. Investigating. Log. Deactivating door. Alerting repair team of potential malfunction. Registering unexpected noise. Investigating. Log. 
Deactivating door. Alerting log. Door activated. Shutting down for diagnostics. What do you suppose they're doing to them? Bad things. Let me see if I can figure out this console. This... no! Do you see? Bodies. Everywhere. What's taking you so long? Almost got it. They're killing them! We have to go now! No, thorns! I can't open it from here. There are two more panels that control this door. I am going to kill every last one of these monsters! We can't go charging in. Our best bet is to sneak in and take them by surprise. Back to work! Break's over! Finally, the console's working. I swear, sneeze on that thing, and it breaks. My tests on the leaf patterns around the central body produce fascinating results. Unexpected sound registered. Investigating. Why do I have a bad feeling? Log. Query answered. Unexpected sound was door pan registering unexpected noise. Investigating. Log alert. Unactivated. Repair team of potential malfunction. We will destroy this entire place. What is this? Who let this creature out of its cage? Someone's fire! You monster. You're dead. Oh, security! Security! I'll take care of them. Go stealthily and neutralize their leader.
almost had me there. Good thing my defense shielding is active. Yes, one down. Wait, what? Why? No! Cease your attacks! I feel a strong energetic connection between us and those constructs. Oh, you noticed. We've learned that your kind's life force does wonders for our golem's power levels. This stops now. These monsters will pay a steep price for their cruelty. Focus on their leader. Hello, crew? Some reinforcements would be appreciated. Okay, crew, your shields will protect you against the creature's attacks. Now find that creature while I maintain the shield generators. Could be anywhere. Generator malfunctioning. I nearly lost my shield. I'm more resilient than I appear. It'll <laughs> take more than that to best me. Resistant! 
Crew, hook the babbling one up to my golem. Immediately. Stop! Ah! You're surprisingly formidable. But this should re-establish my superiority. This is real life. Pain. Pain. Humiliation and eventually death. For us and for them. You have to kill them. Me? Oh, it was all in the interest of knowledge gained. You beings are an anomaly. It wasn't personal. I am going to tear your ears off. You! Don't let it get away! No. Where did it go? No! Got away. Forget that monster. It's time to go home. We have to get the injured back to safety. I don't like being bested. I refuse to be anyone's fool. Not these horrible creatures, and certainly not Wynne's. Stop obsessing. By now, Wynne is all the way out in the Silver Waste. And you're not a fool. Wynne is guarding an important secret. No one person should control our fate, my love. You really think she knows something she's not telling us? I know she does. She said to Mother, they can never know. It could exert unspeakable power over all Silvari. I must know what that power is. Once the Sprouts are safe, you and I are going out to the Silver Wastes to confront her.
Some must fight so that all may be free. Back to defend DR if it comes to that. Is it true that the head of this? Just hope our equipment isn't all jammed with sand we need. Stand your ground. ground. I don't mind that I invited some friends in case we need backup. Here. Why don't you do the talking with these creatures up ahead? You have a better way with strangers. Act, but always with wisdom. among these animals. She mocks us as sacrifices. They are not with us. How do 
we know they aren't lying to us? Let's just go track her down. Well, look who's here at last. Ah, uh, Wynne. Look, you have visitors. Kaith, Fallon. My friends here had ancestors who knew Ventari. They're almost like cousins. <laughs> I am no kin to animals, and I am tired of Ventari's nonsense. You need to come with us now. No, Fallon. I go where I please. And just now, it pleases me to stay among friends. You've already dragged us halfway across Tyria to collect you, dear. Wynne, you may remain with us as long as you wish. As our guest, you are entitled to our protection. This is no concern of yours, my friend. Wynne is our sister. Kaith, I would have words with you. Now. By all means, have words, Kaith. Just make our point clear. Huh. Oh, you will regret doing that.
a chase, so be it. any of this.
my poor friends. I'm so, so sorry. Some friend you are. They gave you shelter here so you could hide with them from us. Then you set them against us, and just look what happened. They might have overwhelmed Kate and I had my friends not happened along to help us. Stop. I can't be here another moment. I won't. I don't believe it. There she goes again. can never have too much treasure. Battle awaits. <laughs> <laughs> 